Okay, so you can see me. The, uh, I have a little bit of an update here for my 2000 Xterra. Um, it's been a while since I've made a video about it, um, but hopefully this winter I'm going to go back out with my buddy's Jeep that uh, is on uh, my other video, uh, and we're going to go back and do another, uh, another snow run. So, anyways, I'll just start off with the basics. Uh, so far, I got a new exhaust. It's right up there. It is a, uh, it's a thrush exhaust. And, uh, it's pretty sweet. It's kind of high up there, but uh, definitely sounds a lot better. Uh, I took my spare tire out. As you can see, I played with my, my rig here. It's all muddy, the way it's supposed to be. Ugh. Got some uh, some new tattoos. My uh, naval aviation stickers, kind of hard to see. That's for work. And some more stickers here. So uh, some add some horsepower there, just like all the Honda fanatic guys. I. Uh, a buddy sticker that he made. I made that one. He made that one. So uh, there's that. Let's see what else I got here. Got my uh, CB antenna. This is a four in or four foot fire stick whip. Uh, of course, got to have the spring, and this is a uh, a fire stick um, rear hatch mount. So more stickers here. The zone is the lift pucks that I got um, for my body lift. I have yet to put it on. I'm going to be putting on here with the next two weeks or so. Cal Mini. These are my shackles that I got. <clears throat> so there's that guy. See if I can focus for you. Come on, focus. Focus. There we go. So. Uh, that helps out. I also cranked my torsion bars. Got all my graphics from uh, from Creepy at GraveyardGraphics.com. He is a member on uh, my Club Xterra forum. More high life, and uh, got some more more body artwork there, and uh, all down the side. And we'll start off simple first. I got new 700 uh, FF Hellas in the front. And uh, some navigators up top. I have yet to get the B&M light bar from uh, another member on clubxterra.com. Uh, it kind of makes it low profile. It makes them all line up the way they're supposed to. It makes it look nice. Um, let's see here. I haven't really done much of the front end. Um, I just got these, and I'm happy to say they're 33s. Um, they're BF Goodrich Cam 2s. Freaking badass is what they are. So, took some plastics off of here so these things will fit. Uh, the next addition that I'm doing with the body, I'm going to uh, rhino line half of this fender trim. And right where this line is right here, all the way down and up the fender well. Or the fender flare. Um, in order to make it look a little, a little cooler. So... Yeah, there's that. I'm also going to be tinting that window right there, or the, both the side windows. Uh, that's about it for the exterior mods. Uh, well, I actually did get that uh, roof basket as well. Makes it look pretty sweet, like a little mohawk. Uh, sorry if my rig's a bit of a mess. Uh, of course, I had some fun in it. Um, <clears throat> that light's for the Hellas, or the switch is for the Hellas. Um, so, yeah. I'm about to add another switch for the navigators uh, when I wire them up. Painted that uh, a pretty blue color. Gauges and all that. Uh, this mount right here for my GoPro camera. Uh, and my Garmin. Well, it's my girlfriend's Garmin. Right, let's see what else we got here. A little, little Radio Shack CB that... Uh, a good buddy of mine let me use or borrowed or gave to me. It's it's his decision. I have yet to clarify that with him. Um, what else we got here? Well, I took my Lobo rack out. I had a rack that went uh, went across 
that way and I can mount supplies and stuff on it, uh, which is pretty cool. Um, but it took that out. Uh, well, it, it should have gone up there, up top and around that, but uh, I put it across from my dog because uh, he likes to jump over the seats and stick his face right here. Yeah, stick his face right here and kind of kind of get in the way of my driving. So, anyways, uh, some more additions are under the hood. No, you're not going to see a, a blown 3.3 liter engine, but you're just going to see a regular 3.3. And a bunch of mud all over it. So here we go. This is what I got. Got a new uh, marine battery, deep cycle battery. Uh, I got to plug my windshield uh, wiper motor in since it's actually starting to rain here. Uh, I like to say uh a lot. It's just because I'm thinking of what I've done. Um, took out my fan shroud and I'm going to be replacing this fan and uh, just not putting anything on the clutch. Uh, and getting an electric fan from a 2000 Quest van. Um, I'm also taking the alternator from the Quest van. And smartly, as Nissan put down there, is the alternator at the very bottom of the engine where all the mud is. That's intelligent. Uh, so yeah, I had a K&N intake in there until it got gummed up with mud and then um, my mass airflow sensor got all crappy and then it sucked into my engine, so now I hear a weird sound with it. I'm gonna be, um, uh, from this point on, I'm gonna be drilling, taking this fender off, drilling out uh, some holes so I can bolt on some PVC, have it run through the fender, cut a hole in this, probably about like that, and have the PVC run up here. I'm gonna spray paint it black. I'm gonna get Safari top, so it, uh, uh, so I can have my own homemade snorkel for like 30 bucks. It's pretty sweet. Um, that's about it for the engine. Um, thinking about taking my air conditioning out, but I don't know. Who knows so far. Uh, yeah, so that's really about it. That's just my update on the on the Xterra here. So I'm going to close this hood real quick. Get kind of an overview on it. Okay. So here's the new improved Xterra. Come on, focus. Focus, focus. There we go. So yeah. That's the new Xterra look. About to lift it another five inches. Hopefully here within the next couple months. So it's not bad. Not bad at all. I'm actually gonna, I'm gonna put some reverse lights up top too, so and have those mounted on a switch. So yeah, not too shabby. I'm proud of it so far. It's done. Uh, it's done a great job helping me out. It's locked on the trails and such, so definitely is a good, good little rig. And that is the update for my Xterra.